bill hopes to extend the Swamp Rabbit Trail into their city limits. There's no direct link to the current trail, but they're already getting ready to build their own through downtown. 7 News reporter Kirsten Glavin has the details from Simpsonville. This is a one mile stretch of trail that City Council voted to start building right here at the start of Trade Street all the way down toward Fairview Road. Now, while it may be isolated to start, the big picture is to connect it to a growing network of trails already in this area. This one actually has a little bit of a shock absorber in it. For bike shops like Cycle, Haas, and Simpsonville, getting a new bike trail through the downtown area is a game changer. I think it's going to be really cool. It's going to be getting more people in here. The small business sits right near Trade Street in the middle of downtown, where the one mile stretch of path is set to start. Simpsonville City Council voting unanimously to invest 450000 into laying asphalt and fixing stormwater piping to build the trail out to Fairview Road. Well, they will be exposed to all of our wonderful shopping here in the downtown area, our restaurants, some of our unique places, such as some of the gift shops. While it's only a small strip, city officials say their vision goes on for miles, with goals to continue building a local network of trails to eventually connect to neighboring cities in the Golden Strip area. City Administrator Diana Gracely says they're working with Greenville County to ultimately connect it to the Swamp Rabbit Trail. The idea is to have the spine of the Swamp Rabbit, if you will, extend from ICAR along the existing railway um, all the way through the Golden Strip area. So this would be part of that spine of the system. Meanwhile, one local organization called the Golden Strip Trail Group is facilitating those meetings with neighboring city leaders and with the community to to hopefully link it all. We're working all together to try to make this happen. So we're starting with a one mile piece, but you know, hopefully it'll be many, many miles of trails. And the next phase of this project is to connect this one mile stretch of trail toward Heritage Park. Reporting in Simpsonville, Kirsten Glavin, 7 News. Kirsten says that trail could be ready for use by this fall.